Hello Cancer. So this is your weekly reading. I'm going to start with the tarot. Okay, so you guys, what's the current energy? So you guys got the five of wands, ace of cups. I feel like this is probably pertaining to the single Cancers. A lot of people want to go out with you. A lot of people want to date you. Um, getting a lot of attention, a lot of gifts from a lot of people. <laughs> okay, so you see what I'm getting. You know, first, the person that's on Cancer mind, who this person wants to say to Cancer, the star, okay? So someone is fighting for you, someone that you, um, someone that's an ex of yours, okay? They want to reconnect with you. Could be Aquarius, or Aries, you know, first, the person that's on Cancer mind, what does this person keep in hidden from Cancer? Universe, Queen of Pen, oh. This person needs help, okay? This, this is someone who, it's fighting for you. However, they have hmm, they have another person. I don't know if this person's a rebound or they've been with this person for years and they're not in love with this person, but they still not going to leave them. Okay? But they do have someone else that there's um that they're connected to still. Universe the person Universe, the person that's on Cancer line, how does this person feel about Cancer? Knight of Wands. So this person is really into you. Um, they they find you very attractive. Okay. Universe, the person that's on Cancer mind, what is this person's true feelings for Cancer? Wheel of Fortune, they want to come back around. They want to work on this. And the strength. Okay, I feel like this is someone probably who's with their rebound or they're with someone that they're not in love with anymore, but they're not doing anything to completely cut ties with this person. They feel like you are the one that got their heart. Universe, the person that's on Cancer Mind. What are this person's intentions with Cancer? The Fool. This is someone who's... They're... They're not serious. They're not serious at all. They don't know what they want. I feel like they want to have you and the other person. Okay? Because they feel like something's missing from both connections. Universe, the person that's on Cancer Mind, what action will this person take with Cancer? Nine of Pentacles. Probably you haven't heard from this person for a while. They're coming your way. You probably don't see it. Probably you guys don't even care about the situation no more. You haven't heard from them for a while again. And you move on, but they're coming your way. Universe, cut for the Knight of Pentacles. Universe, cut for the Knight of Pentacles. The Seven of Wands, Hangman, you've always been on their mind, okay? They're coming your way. Someone that you haven't heard from for a while, but they're connected to someone else, and I feel like they're still not serious. Universe, cut for the Queen of Pentacles and the Magician. Look at that. They're still connected to someone, probably married. Or live with this person. Universe, cut for the fool. Queen of Swords. Universe, cut for the Queen of Swords. Knight of Wands. Yeah, so when they try to come reconnect with you, they're going to kind of not dress elf in the room. They're going to pretend like nothing happened, okay? This person could be an Earth sign towards very Capricorn or a fellow Cancer. There is some Aries and Aquarius and Sagittarius and Leo in this, um, in this spread too. Virgo, you got almost every sign. But I would say it's probably most likely an Earth sign um, or a Cancer, fellow Cancer. So let's look at this deck. Okay, so Universe, give me a four card spread. Universe, give me a four card spread. The messages you have for. Cancer Aries here. You can find some different cards and messages you have for Cancer. So focus on monetary issues. Focus on um, on spirit. Gemini, you always have a choice. And the higher fit. So yeah, I feel like a lot of you guys are in another relationship and you guys are happy there. This is just someone I feel like you have a lot of like a lot of trauma bonds. Um, you've been with this person for a while and they probably was feelings there. I feel like that's the person that's resurfacing, okay? But I feel like you guys are going to stay faithful to your person that you're currently with if you are currently with someone. If you are single, I feel like this is just you standing firm. You're not allowing this person back into your life. 
this is someone again who's always juggling they always with someone else i feel like whoever they with as well this woman or this man been with them for a long time okay so even though they're not fulfilled with this person they're still going to be connected to this person so let's look at the suck Right, universe, give me a face card spread. What messages do you have for cancers? Worry, surrender, and pride and fear. Okay, some of you guys are worried about something. It could be like relating to career, work, finance. Okay, I feel like what the universe is trying to say is don't be in this energy. Seek a plan, seek a solution, be action oriented. Don't get too caught up with your emotions. The universe, clarify pride. Friendship. This could also be a friend, a friend that's no longer a friend to you. This is someone who's shady. Okay, universe clarify friendship. Service could be a user piece and adversity. You feel like this person's not there for you when you're there for them. So I feel like if it, I see that you guys are just probably going to end that friendship because you feel like it's not balanced, it's not reciprocated. Let's look here. So universe, we have four cards. Why do you just see you have four cancer? Not really. Gift. I see a lot of gifts coming your way. I do see a lot of support and help. So if you feel like something's been blocked, I feel like you will get some help from somebody. Universe, clarify just the horizons. Thief, despair, and great fortune. I feel like well, someone will help you out. Okay. Yes, I can. Universe, we have three cards. What messages do you have for cancer? You want to leave my cards. What messages do you have for cancer when it comes to the above line? So there is strength, denial, the moon, and obedience. So I feel like this person is probably going to resurface during Leo season. Okay. Um, you are going to deny them. I feel like the obedience, because a lot of you guys are in a relationship, so you're going to be faithful to your person. But also, for those who are single, you guys know that this is someone who's not loyal, okay? Um, this is someone that could have been in your life, in and out, for a long time, and you broke that chain of cycles when it comes to this. Universe, give me a four card spread. What messages do you have for cancers? Okay. Universe, give me two more cards. Universe, give me one more card. What message do you have for cancers? Universe, give me one more card. Okay, they all came out reverse. Wow. Okay. So there is crossing bridges. It's time for healing, connecting, mending, and releasing, okay? So probably when you guys broke up with them, things was left unsaid, undone, but you you felt like that was, you know, that was best for you to just leave things unsaid and done. Um, this person felt like they didn't got closure, okay? Then there is mystic healer. Healing energy flows through you and reverse what you need to release in waning moon in reverse so probably there is still some form of resentment or regret universe wants you to release this energy emotions are running high super moon okay so things yeah i feel like emotionally things have been blocked meditate and contemplate new moon and pisces in reverse could be a pisces um in the time to give rather than take new moon and virgo so there's been blocks okay let's see what it's about universe clarify new moon and virgo and reverse it's time to give rather than take wise leader you are beacon for others blessings are shot into your life yeah i feel like what i'm trying to say here is like not necessarily give like financially i feel like it's more so like 
continue to be a positive person. Don't let negative situations or people affect you. Okay, that's what I'm getting. Don't let people affect you where they're getting the best out of you and it's changing you. Now you're becoming like them. No, continue to be a positive person. Continue to be a light, okay? So, let's look at the angel answers. Okay, me and friends, we have four cards, but I don't messages. So, can't. Or cancers, opportunity after your angels. There's something that you really want to happen. The universe wants you to connect with them more. Your ancestors, God, whatever you believe in. The universe wants you to connect with them more. Probably even really focus on a 3D, you know, on work, paying bills. Take some time to create a spiritual routine. That's going to serve as a catalyst of what you want. Okay, then with the next few weeks, a peace resolution, okay. Things will get better, okay? Things will get better. Just don't let things stress you. Don't let things um, consume you, okay? That's what I'm seeing. So that's the reading I have for you, Cancer. 